Welcome in everybody. So today is Monday. Monday is the only day that we are uh, we were not set up. And uh, what I do is I come in and clean. And what we're going to do now is we're going to pull our grates out. We do that every Monday, and um, we're going to get them uh, power washed. Then we'll come back, wipe down inside and we'll get our grill clean so uh you can see i got some carbon build up on the grill um where i set up the way my trailer is it's kind of it's on an angle on a slope so you can see that grease always settles to that back corner um even with the vehicle jacked up so that is one week of grease build up in these crates. So we're gonna get these pulled out and uh, get them cleaned up. So they're pretty dirty, but we're gonna take care of that. Then we'll come back and we'll get to all this wiped out, nice and clean. We'll get up in there and we'll scrub down in there as well. Get our hood cleaned for the week. All right, so here we are, we're at our local car wash, and uh, we got our grates. We sprayed them down with some degreaser, and then we selected engine cleaner. And we'll hit them with that engine cleaner real quick. All right. Now we'll go to wash. All right, we got them all power washed. Voila. Nice and clean. So this one's above my fryer. So this one really gets hot, gets some baked on grease, but that's certainly a lot better than what it was. And that's how we clean our grates on Monday. Now we'll go back and uh, we'll get the rest of the hood cleaned up. All right, so we're back in the trailer. We got our grates washed. And now we're going to clean up inside the hood here. Get our drip pans 
washed out. And we'll get all this grease out of here. Scrub that down above the fryer. We'll be back. Okay, and there you have it. So, what I use is just a, a general cleaner, bleach cleaner, to uh, help fight through any of the grease and crud that's up on there, right? And then I use this stainless steel uh, polisher, cleaner polisher, um, and that does a really good job. We wipe most of our walls and prep station and tables down the same way at the end of the day but uh, here's our finished finished hood channel nice and clean now we'll get our grates back uh, inside This is my dirtiest one that stays above my uh, fryer. them hook back up. And there you go. Nice and clean. Looks great. I mean, ready to go to work and 
I mean, you look at it and, you know, you just feel good. Just feel good. And customers see that. Um, have one customer comment like, wow, I've never seen a hood look that clean ever. Um, so it's a sense of uh, pride. So hope you like this video. Please share, subscribe, comment, you know, all that good stuff. Hit the like button. I appreciate it. Uh, later, we're going to flush and clean our fryer. Get that all cleaned out. Get that scrubbed down. And uh, get some fresh oil in there. So, thanks for watching. Okay, so we're back and we're going to scrub out our fryers, um, flush them out and uh, we do that every Monday. Now our oil is drained every evening um, and it's strained so that helps keep the oil clean but on Mondays we um, flush it out with a hose and we, we scrub it down and so that's a week's worth of use right there. We change our oil every other week. Um, this fryer right here has only been used one time. So I got two 40 pound fryers. Uh, we used this one. Uh, we had an event we went to. So we're going to get all that flushed out, get it scrubbed down and then we will have our hood done and our fryers. So let's get on with that. All right, so we'll go ahead and flush her out. Go ahead, spray it down, flush it out. Then we'll put the, the grease in it. And because we do scrub it out every week, as you can see, it's um, it's really not bad. So we'll get some degreaser in there and we'll scrub it. So we scrubbed on it for about five, six minutes. We're gonna flush it again. See what it looks like. spots to let them soak a minute and then uh, go back and scrub it a little more and get it wet down. We're gonna flush this one out, clean this one a little bit while this one is uh, soaking with some degrease here. Scrubbed her down again. 
give it one final rinse. Should be okay. And we'll wipe her down with clean cloth and some water. Oh yeah, much better. This one, like I said, isn't really dirty. We've only used this one time. And I keep it wrapped with foil quite a bit. So what I do is I keep one of the jugs after I fill it every week. I just keep one of, every other week, I keep one of these jugs in the back of the uh, truck. So when I flush them out on Monday, I got something obviously to let them drain in. Oh yeah, looking like they're new again. All right, get these drained out and we'll get them wiped down and um, we'll be back in a minute. All right, so there you go. So what we use on the grills is this Easy Off. And uh, works really good. But here they are. And that's what my fryers look like come Tuesday morning for work. Every week. And that's why our fries are nice and golden crispy. So a nice clean hood to start the week and some real nice clean fryers. I mean, yeah, it takes a couple minutes, but it's worth it. So we're gonna take that easy off. I'm gonna spray it on this grill, let that soak and set up. And tomorrow is a rain day, so we won't be set up. So we'll tackle that grill tomorrow. So if you like this video, and you think I'm doing a good job, not only in the food trailer, but showing you how I clean um, like my hood and grill and fryers um, consider giving it a thumbs up and maybe subscribe I'd really appreciate it um, Mr. Chime Time we're ready for you anytime you want to come to Salisbury sample some of our food come on so until next time peace out All right, so I've been scrubbing on it for about, I don't know, five, six minutes. And uh, let's give it a scrape and see what we got. We got some of it off, but uh, I think we could do a lot better. So we'll spray her down again with some Easy Off and uh, let it sit a minute. another new screen and we'll scrub it some more right back 
All right, I got it scrubbed down a second time. Had to turn on the uh, hood and the makeup air. The uh, smell from that degreaser was a little overpowering. took off of this grill. All right, I'm gonna wash this down, rinse it, clean it, get all that detergent off of it, and uh, we'll see what it looks like when we're finished, okay? But uh, it's gonna look a lot better. As you can see, it's brand spanking new, never used. I open up the box just to make sure shape we will pay for a shipping the only thing that you have to do is subscribe and we will ship this to you share this video put it on your food truck food trailer groups when we select the winner we will message you and uh, you can give us your address and we will probably ship this, oh, I imagine UPS to you, okay? 